This is Laura Spencer with Tuts Plus. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Google Gmail Tasks List Utility. The Tasks List Utility is a very helpful utility that allows you to create a to-do list right within your Gmail window. Start with the main Gmail window open and to create your Tasks List go to the left where you'll see the word Gmail and click the arrow next to the word Gmail and click the word Tasks. You'll see your task list opens on the right hand side of your screen. Right now it's empty, but to add a task all we need to do is simply start typing. And each time I'm adding a new task I'm hitting enter and then just simply typing what I want the task to be. Once I've entered as many tasks as I'd like on my list, I can add detail to each task. To add detail, I click on the task that I want to add the detail to and click on the arrow to the right hand side of the task to open the Edit Details window. On the Edit Details window, I can add a due date and add notes to the task. Let's do that. Click on the due date field and a calendar appears and all I need to do is click on the date when I want the task to be due. To enter notes, I click in the notes field and I type the note that I want to add to my task. When I'm done adding details to my task, I go back to my list clicking on the back to list link and the details that I just entered appear below the task. I can also change the way the tasks appear on my list. I can move a task up and down by clicking on the task, going to my actions menu, and click down to move the task down, or click move up to move the task back up. I can create a subtask by clicking clicking on a task and indenting it, which makes it a subtask of the task above it. If I change my mind about a task and un unindent it, it goes back to the regular level task. If I want to delete a task, I simply select the task and click on the trash icon. I can also display the tasks in different orders. I can sort by the due date and the one that doesn't have a due date shows at the bottom. Return to my original sort order. I can mark a task completed by checking on the checkbox next to the task and then show just my completed tasks. The Gmail test utility is particularly helpful because you can also use it from within Google Calendar. Let me show you how that works. I have Google Calendar open in another tab, so I'll switch to Google Calendar now and open up my task list within Google Calendar. Okay, I have Google Calendar open. This is the main calendar window. To open my task list, I'm going to click on Reminders, click the down arrow to the right of the word Reminders, and it brings up this pop-up. And at the top of the pop-up, it says Switch to Tasks, so I click on Switch to Tasks, and my task list automatically displays on the right-hand side of my Google Calendar. I can modify, edit, and make any changes to my Google task list within Calendar. Let me show you how that works. Just do everything I did before. I can click to add a new task. I can mark a task completed. And any changes that I make in Google Calendar also appear in my Gmail inbox. Let me show you. I'll switch back to my Gmail inbox by clicking on that tab and I refresh the screen. And you can see that the changes I just made in Google Calendar now appear on my Gmail task list within Gmail. So today we've learned how to create a task list, how to add tasks, how to change the order of our task list, and also how to use our task list within both Gmail and Google Calendar. 
This has been Laura Spencer for Tuts Plus.